All right. Our first question is going to be a demo question, and it'll appear on the screen now. What is 1,012 plus 1,012? Okay, we got a lot of answers already. This is great. It looks like people are understanding how to use the Kahoot. Okay, almost everyone got this question right, but even if you didn't get the question right, it's okay because that was just a demo question. Now let's get on to the actual questions. Question number two, how much change would you get for paying a $10 bottle of water with six $2 bills and 10 nickels? As you can see, all the answer choices are low and we already have over 30 answers, which is great. And it's okay if you don't answer right away because as you can see, there's a timer on the left, which will show you how much time is left. Okay, we have almost everyone answering this question. And about five seconds left. All right, let's see. Okay, almost everyone got this question correct. And let's take a look at the leaderboard. All right, Carolyn is in first place right now, followed by Addison, Selena, Hayden, and Kaylee. Great job, all of you. And let's go on to question number three. How many pairs of positive integers satisfy the equation a plus 2b equals 12? Wow, a lot of people have answered this already. You guys are very, very fast. About 15 seconds remaining, and we do almost have everyone responding to this. Five seconds left. All right, so we got a little bit of a split for this question. It was actually five. Now let's see if the leaderboard changed at all. All right, Selena is in the lead now with Carolyn and second and Mohini and Hayden and Yuno. Great job, everyone. Question number four. How many ways are there to make an ordered string of six letters using the first seven letters of the alphabet? As you can see, the answers for this question are quite large. And we already have over 20 answers, over 30 answers now. Great job, everyone, for your participation. All right, about five seconds left. You guys are super, super fast at this. All right, most people got this correct, but some people did not, which is okay. And our scoreboard changed again with Selena still in first and Hayden climbing to second. Nice job for Aaron and Mohini for getting on the leaderboard. Question number five. What is the degree measure of each vertex angle in a regular pentadecimal, which is a polygon with 15 sides? The answers for this one are definitely pretty close together, but we already have over 20 answers. And about 10 seconds left in this question, we have a majority of the people already responding. Okay, almost everyone got this question right as well. Nice job. Okay, the leaderboard changed again. Selena's still in first, but Carolyn is back to second. Great job, everyone. Question number six. The average of A and B is 68, while the average of A, B, and C is 72. What is the value of C? Okay, you guys are actually so fast at this. Wow, we have almost 30 responses already and not even half the time is left here. All right, about five seconds left to put in your answers. Okay, great job, everyone. Over 30 people got this one correct. And it looks like Selena and Carolyn are still in first and second, but Aaron and Ava and Ashanvi have climbed up. Question number seven. What is the remainder when eight to the power of four is divided by five? Hmm, we already got 
almost 20 answers for this question so far, which is very, very fast. Almost over 30 now. All right, and about 10 seconds left. We only have a few people who haven't answered this. And over 30 of you guys got this one correct as well. Wow, you guys are doing so well. And it looks like Ava has climbed up to third place and Ashanti in fourth. Question number eight. If Amy takes one hour to paint a fence while Bailey takes two hours to paint the same fence, how much time do they take to paint the fence together? And the answers for this question are all in minutes, as you can see. Wow, not even 10 seconds and already over 20 answers, over 30 answers now. Great job, everybody. All right, and about five seconds left. Almost everyone has answered this question now. All right, 30 people answered this one correctly. And it looks like the leaderboard hasn't changed. And Kaylee is making a comeback with three in a row. Nice job, Kaylee. All right, question number nine, another geometry question. We have four points, A, B, C, D, in that order, lying on a circle. If the degree measure of angle A, B, C is 130 and A, C, B is 20 degrees, what is the measure of B, D, C? All right, this question is definitely a bit slower. As you can see, there's only 10 answers so far, but there's still time for this question. About 40, 30 seconds left. So take your time for this one for sure. And the paper might be useful for this one. Okay, but we already have over 20 answers, which is very, very impressive. And we have about half of the time left. Yeah, so far you guys are doing a really great job at answering these questions. And about 10 seconds left, so if you have an answer, you might as well put it in now. All right, almost everyone has responded now. And a little less than 30 people got this one correct, but great job to everyone for trying on that either way. Okay, the leaderboard definitely changed for this one. With you know on the leaderboard now, great job to everyone. Question number 10. A flight took off at 2.52 p.m. and takes 773 minutes to land, where the time is five hours behind. What time is landing? I have a bunch of different times as the answer for this question, and we definitely have more time for this question. So definitely take your time to get the answer. Okay, this one was also a little bit slower than the previous one. We have about 20 answers now, and now half of the time left to answer. Okay, almost 30 answers for this one. Great job, everybody. All right, we're slowly increasing the amount of answers and about 10 seconds left for this one. Okay, now almost everyone has answered this one. Okay, let's see. 27 people again got this question right. Nice job, everyone. And Selena is still in the lead and we have Tanishka in fifth place right now. Great job, everyone. Question number 11. How many faces are there in a polyhedron with 28 edges and 18 vertices? Okay, a lot of people answered this one right away, but do take your time on this one. Okay, almost 20 answers. That's about half of you All right, about 10 seconds left for this one. Okay, a bunch of you guys just answered no. And the answer was 12. So this one was definitely a bit more split. Okay, Selena is still in need, 
but Sean is in second now and Tanishka is in third. Great job, everyone. Question number 12, our second to last question. How many ways are there to tile a two by five grid with one by two and two by one pieces? All right, we got two answers, three answers right away. This is also another question where you have 60 seconds to answer. Okay, almost, we have 10, 11 answers now. And you definitely have more time for this question. Okay, we have over 20 answers now, 25 answers. And still about 20 seconds left to think about this one. The answers are definitely pretty close. So definitely make sure you're counting accurately. And about 10 people still have to answer this one. And we have about five seconds left. Hmm. Okay, 20 people got this one correct, which is great. Selena has the highest answer streak of 12 questions. Great job, Selena, and to the rest of you on the leaderboard as well. Now for our last question, we have a game with 25 stones. On each turn, you can pick up one, two, three, or four stones. If you go first, alternating taking turns with another player, can you guarantee a win? Okay, a lot of people already answered this question. Great job to all of you for being so fast at this. Oh my gosh. And the correct answer was no. And this one definitely got a bunch of you because a bunch of you picked yes. So let's take a look at the podium now and see if it changed at all. In third place, we have a Sean V. In second place, we have Aaron. And in first place, we have Selena. Congratulations to everyone and our runners up, Tanishka and Yuno. That was a very, very fun Kahoot. And thank you all for participating in that. We will contact the winners about the winner, Selena, about her $25 gift card after the ceremony. Thank you guys all for participating in that.